We are waiting a two full years on The Last of Us Season 2 only to find out it will have less episodes than Season 1. Welcome back guys to Fog Entertainment and some surprising news we found out by director Craig Masson and Neil Druckmann that Season 2 of The Last of Us will not be this larger scale season that we were all expecting. We were expecting a 16 episode, a 13 episode, something along those lines. Obviously, The Last of Us Part 2 in length is like at least double the length of the first game. They gave us 9 episodes in Season 1, so people were kind of expecting that Season 2 would go a lot more than that, but it turns out that is not the case, and it has been confirmed that The Last of Us Season 2 will only have 7 episodes, unlike Season 1, which was spanned across 9, and I think the big question is, I mean, what the hell is the wait then? Why do we have to wait 2 years on a 7 episode season. It just doesn't make much sense to me. Now, there is a bit of a time skip. Maybe they want it to intentionally wait to try and age up early, but I mean, I'm not buying that. The actress that plays her, I think, is 20. I think by the time of the second game, Ellie's already 19. She's supposed to be 14 in the first game. They could have surely just aged up with makeup or at least attempted not to age the actress down. Either way, it's dumb. I mean, why are we doing this now? What happened to the good old days where good shows could give us seasons back to back to back? I'm not buying it that, oh, if you want a good season, you have to wait two years. I mean, fuck no. That shouldn't be the case. I, I don't think that is right at all. Maybe it's an HBO thing. I don't know if they've just got lazy. But we used to see good television shows every single year produce a new season. And some of them were doing a hell of a lot more than seven. You, you look at Sons of Anarchy. They never took an extra year out. Every single season was the ne very next year. You look at The Walking Dead. Up till like COVID happened, they were releasing seasons like every single season. Same with Breaking Bad, although they did break down season five. That's fair enough because Breaking Bad's epic. Breaking Bad's one of the best, if not the best show of all time. But for them to give us a two year wait and then announce that season two will only have seven episodes, I don't understand that. Um, in terms of what will happen in these seven episodes, I know that in the game, spoiler alert guys in case anyone's listening at this point, I hope you are, but if you're not then it doesn't matter, and if you are then cover your ears in case you don't know, but uh, Joel dies like probably what, an hour into the game maybe, even less than that, I don't know, I haven't played the second game, don't want to play the second game, don't really want to watch any more of this show, but I will for the channel of course. So um, yeah, I don't exactly know what they will do for the first seven episodes, could they drag his death out and have that be uh, the finale, I mean, I, I guess that is possible, I, f I think they could do that, but we'll have to wait and see, I mean, who knows, maybe it won't be in chronological order, they could try and, I wouldn't be surprised if they give us quite a lot of just Abbey episodes here out of this seven, they, they could do that, if they give you like three or four Abbey episodes, then they could easily get to episode seven, the finale of season two, and have that be the episode where Joel dies, so... I think that could be the case, because some people were wondering, like, would Joel die within the first two episodes, or the first, like, three episodes, or maybe even the first episode. Now we know that it's going to be seven episodes, and that the rest of The Last of Us Part 2 is apparently going to be shown over seasons three and four. So, yeah, Part 2, then, is going to last over three seasons of the show. If the seasons are going to be shorter than season one, then that makes sense. If we're going to maybe season three will only be seven episodes, maybe season four will only be seven episodes. I did say at the time that the first game should have been covered over multiple seasons, and I think they messed it up. I think they fucked it up. They rushed the first game. The, every time you got a new character, you pretty much knew they were going to die at the end of the episode, or they got introduced late, and then they died at the next episode, and you, you just never really got time with the characters, and I'm not even going to talk about the two filler episodes they've done, they changed up with all the gay shit, I'm not even going to talk about that, but you look at Tess, 
I think Tess should have been around for most of season one. You you could have split it into four seasons. Honestly, you could you could have, but for Tess to die in episode two, it was too quick. Then they bring in the brothers that they meet and they die. They bring them in at the very end of an episode, then they die at the end of the next. Um, you look at Bill, not but was it Bill? Yeah, Bill. So you got Bill who they bring in, they completely change it up from the game. Bill would have been a great character that you could have had in three to four episodes, but no, they just done it one and done. And the only interaction that Joel and Bill had was through flashbacks. And then the same with um, the the guy, the, the human cannibal that eats kids. I forget his name. Uh, apologies for, for forgetting his name, but even him, you know, he, he gets brought in for one episode, he dies at the end of it. When you look at that story arc in the game, that should have been another character that lasted like three, four, five episodes, but they rushed it. I don't understand why they done that, you know, I think it's dumb, guys. For me, I think the first game should have been at least minimum two seasons, and they didn't do that, and now they're going to they're gonna do the second game over three seasons, but shorter seasons, so it's going to probably work out like two normal seasons. I don't know. Let us know your thoughts down below. Disappointing. You know, we get this long wait only to find out that they're going to give us just a mere seven episodes. I don't see the point in it. I don't know why they couldn't have just gave us it the, the very next year after part one, but whatever, guys. Let us know your thoughts. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.